What is it? It's meatloaf. Oh, looks good. Good job. I'm proud of you. <laughs> looks real good. If I die, you're... Nope, mm -mm. stop. Sorry, man, can I help you? Yeah, I'm, uh, I'm here to go viral on TikTok. Nope, sorry, not on the list. What? Why not? You're not a super hot girl, and you're not lip syncing, so. Ah, oh, but I'm super funny. Oh, damn, baby, look at you. Listen, I know you may get this a lot, but you are beautiful. Girl, I'll make you, I can sing my ABCs to you. See, I'll give you an A because you're awesome, a B because you're beautiful, a C because you're confident, and I'll give you this D because you deserve it. <laughs> So, my girl's trying to make me exercise more, and I don't know what she's doing, but it's definitely motivating me to work out. Thanks for helping me work out, honey. I'm from the great white north, right? Like up above the state? Yeah. The big landmass that the rest of the world hates? Fuck yeah. We're like above that. Fucking north, I guess. The big patch of trees where everybody's bored to death. We're just chilling up here, sipping syrup, playing hockey. Y'all enjoy y'all 20s and 30s. Because whenever you're in your 40s, I swear, that check engine light comes on. Most likely to get into a bar fight. Who's the, your who's the smartest? <laughs> Who is the most emotional? <laughs> <laughs> Who is most likely to wake up in jail? <laughs> Who gets with the hottest girls? <laughs> Babe! <laughs> Fuckhead? <laughs> who's the funniest? <laughs> <laughs> Who drinks the most alcohol? <laughs> Who's most likely to catch an STD? What? <laughs> someone comes in this mechanic shop and does not want to deal with me because I have a fucking vagina. If I did not know what the fuck I was doing, I assure you my ass would not be in this fucking shop. Can you guess this song, TikTok? <laughs> oh, you're getting a little too close. Dad! Oh my God! Drive forward! Go forward! Drive forward, you idiot! What? What's wrong? Some people will say, oh, that's just a Porsche. Yeah, whatever. Yeah, it's just a Porsche. Yeah. It's not just a Porsche. It's a jet powered by a Boeing jet engine Porsche. What's up? Catch me outside. How about that? <laughs> the fuck is so funny? <laughs> Bar Movie time! All right, let's see what we got.
If the movie's half as good as the intro, we're in for a real treat, Granny. With one stroke of the marker, make that say 950. 950. 950. One stroke of the pen. That doesn't make sense. It does. One line. One line. 950. Magic. I don't know. You give up? <laughs> yeah. It's 10 to 10. That doesn't even say 9.50. It does, it's 10 minutes before 10 o'clock, 9.50. Okay. So I don't wear a bra, I hate them. Now I'm out for a walk right now with my dog and I come across a woman and her teenage son. And the woman looks at me and goes, ah, disgusting. So I say, ma'am, are you referring to the fact that I'm not wearing a bra? And then she says, so gross. Now I live in a small town, so I figure my chances with this one are pretty good. So I say, ma'am, are you religious? Of course I am. Ma'am, these are the natural shape of my breasts. This is exactly the body that God gave me. It is you who in fact is taking a man-made creation to change the shape and size of your body to be more sexually appealing to other human beings. You, in fact, are the one who is disgusting. How dare you spit in the face of God's creation? After that, she looked at me, looked at her breasts, looked at me again, and walked away. Now I'm not even religious, but it sure shut her up. It's at this moment that you realize that your girlfriend is precariously hanging onto the rope on the edge of a 400 foot cliff, but you're gonna base jump and she's gonna record it for a TikTok because that's awesome and gives you clout. As you take a deep breath and you're about to poop your pants, you realize that you've gotta run off this cliff with as much speed as possible and doing so, you gotta do a gainer because flips are cool and people will like that kind of thing. Bam, the parachute opens and you're like, whoa, gosh, amazing, my parachute works, I'm glad it did. As you're flying along, you realize that you've got to dodge some cliffs and some trees and you see some bushes and you're like, where am I going to land? So you set yourself up for the best possible landing and then there's trees along the way, but just kick the leaves as you go towards the ground at 30 miles an hour. And as you touch down like you won the Super Bowl, you've got to be like, yeah, I own this thing. Now your parachute's about to fall to the ground. As it falls to the ground, the strings and the toggles and things like that are going to try and get tangled up, but you got to make sure they work for the next possible base jump. And then you look up at the cliff and then you realize, uh-oh, I left my girlfriend up there and she's got to walk down.